Hey YouTubers, this is Bob. Well, I'm on my way down to the waterfront. So I invite you guys to come on down with me. Well, hello. It looks like we've discovered a friend here. Hi, would you like to say hi to the YouTubers? What's your name? Hi, can I catch you? Beautiful. Well, you never know who you'll encounter. It's always an adventure. As you look ahead here, you guys can see that we are now approaching the waterfront. It's absolutely lovely here. A lot of lovely homes right here along the water. We'll just stroll on down. Well, YouTubers, we're walking down here towards the waterfront. There's a lot of noise because there's a lot of airplanes here today. And there are people doing lawn work. As you can see behind me here, there's some beautiful homes. And I really love it down here. This is a place I often come in the evenings and I walk and I meditate. Let's stroll on down to the water. Well, here we are. We're down here at the waterfront. And this is the yacht club here. This is where a lot of the boat owners go and have dinner after they park their boats here. Right now, it doesn't look like there are a lot of boats here. But uh, I assure you, it's a wonderful place. You can see the beautiful houses up here on the hill. It's really lovely at this part of Washington. I always have the best of times here. And I invite all you guys to come on down. You know, I've been getting a lot of letters from you guys, and a lot of you have been asking me, you've been saying, Bob, you know, with the fall weather, I get depressed. I have seasonal affective disorder, you know, and I feel like, I just feel like my world is over. Well, I want you to know that that feeling of depression is only temporary. And also, from the ancients' perspective, the fall is a time in which we let go the grievances of the past year. There is oftentimes a lot of sorrow at this time of year. And instead of embracing it, our culture tells us just to get it away, you know, take drugs, be happy. But really, perhaps there's a spiritual lesson in this. Maybe we're supposed to embrace a time of solitude, a time of sorrow. If we grieve, we heal. You know, from the ancient Wiccan perspective, the goddess is grieving because the Lord, the Sun Lord, is dying now. And at Samhain, or Halloween, he passes into the spirit world. And so each of you guys, I want you to think about your own journeys and how you can embrace this time of mourning. Rather than avoiding it, allow it to bless you and enrich you. If we study the trees at this time of year, we notice as we look at the branches and the leaves that the trees are changing colors. And that the trees are dying. They're letting go. Now that doesn't mean that we have to die. But what it does mean from a spiritual place is that we have to allow ourselves to let go. Let go of that which no longer serves you. The fall is a great time of inner reflection. It's a time to do spiritual work. So instead of running from the sorrow, we should embrace it and let ourselves be renewed in our soul, our mind, and our body. Thanks for being with me. This is Bob Hickman, and this has been my Psychic Minute.